Steve Young. As a left-handed quarterback, Steve Young experienced much fun. He could quickly pass and run. run. Yes. <laughs> nice. <laughs> On 4-20-84, as a United States Football League player, Steve began to progress. Yes, progress. He became the first pro to pass for 300 plus and rush for 100 plus yards while playing, playing for, for the, the LA Express. Express. Yes. <laughs> nice. <laughs> On 10-30-88 at Candlestick Park, Steve ran faster than a Toyota. His fourth quarter 49-yard run was the game-winning touchdown against Minnesota. Minnesota. <laughs> On 10-22-89, San Francisco defeated New England, so 49ers fans were elating because Steve threw three touchdown passes while earning a perfect passer rating. rating. In 1991, Steve was no longer waiting. He earned his first of a record six passing titles with the league's highest passer rating. Fans <laughs> wondered. Young earned his first of a record six seasons with a passer rating over 100. Football fans began to glow. Steve began a record of four passing titles in a row. Oh, yes. In 1992, <laughs> Steve played in many towns. He earned his first of a record four times of leading the NFL in passing touchdowns. Yeah, I can feel that one coming. In 1993, <laughs> Steve created the Forever Young Foundation. He led the NFL with 4,270 total offensive yards while helping kids across the nation. Steve earned a law degree while he was in his prime. The NFC Championship game featured SF in Dallas for the third consecutive time. On 11595, the Cowboys came undone. Young threw two touchdowns and rushed for one. At Candlestick Park, <laughs> Steve didn't yield. After the 49ers victory, he celebrated by running around the field. In Super Bowl 29, due to his 325 passing and 49 rushing yards, Steve was key. On 129.95, he was the game's passing and rushing leader, so he was named the MVP. Young also set a Super Bowl record by throwing for six touchdowns, so his 49ers defeated the Chargers, not the Browns. Steve's eight rushing touchdowns and 494 rushing yards were earned in his postseason career, which set quarterback records, so he was a star to revere. Young was great. On 10-5-08, the San Francisco 49ers retired his uniform number eight. eight. Another Hall of Famer was the 49ers' Fred Dean. Steve published QB, My Life Behind the Spiral in 2016. Obviously, Young knows how to write with a pen. He is an awesome analyst on ESPN. Yeah. Bob Dylan and Rod Stewart have spectacularly sung Forever Young. Oh, yeah. Yeah.